guitarings. Guitarings on the road. We're here at NAM. We've got to keep the sound kind of loud because there's lots of extraneous noise. We're right in the heart of NAM Central. And we're sitting with Mark Tremonti. Hi. Mark, what's new? Uh, here at NAM, enjoying NAM, picking out guitars, amps. Uh, we got a guitar uh, uh, solo record coming out. A solo record? Yeah, solo record. Now, why do you have to make a solo record? Are people not bending to your will and your uh, Yeah, bands? you know, I want to exactly what they uh, I had, do. What you want. I had three months off while Miles was on tour with Slash. And I didn't want to waste the time. I've got a lot of ideas that are just sitting around that will never see the light of day, so I figured I'd tackle a solo record. How would you describe like, what your solo record is all about? I'm singing on it. First time I ever sang. Um, you nervous? I already sang it. So I would, yeah, you know, nobody likes to hear the way they, they sound. Yeah, the playback sounds weird. Right? So uh, I'm going to make sure they double it, triple it, quadruple it, make other people harmonize over it until it doesn't sound like me anymore. How did you produce it, or how involved were you in production? I, um, well, the producer was Elvis Pascal. But, you know, I've, I've wrote everything, everything from there I wrote. Um, as far as arrangements went, it was me, Eric uh, Friedman, and Garrett Wedlock. We came together. They're very good sounding boards for which ideas they thought were good and bad. So we all kind of produced it, you know. It was, how many uh, tracks? 14 tracks. Oh, my God. Yeah. Is it pretty, like, guitar-handed stuff? Or? Yeah, yeah, it's got... Um, it's got some of my old roots on there, and some of the more um, metal-y kind of riffs in there, here and there. Um, lots of guitar solos, lots of notes on there. That's good. I think I hit every note on the guitar twice. Oh, yeah, good. Yeah. 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 After the show's over, we got to go back to the stage and look at the footage. Yeah? It looks like we're, jumping off the screen. It's like, it's like we're in Avatar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's sweet. That's cool. How many times have you played Wembley? That's the first time. What was that like? That was pretty exciting. It was great. You know, it wasn't as big as I thought it was. Yeah? I thought it was going to be a big, giant arena. But it was just a, you know, it's like a 12,000 seater. Oh, know? is that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The fame out to makes it bigger. Yeah. And then, do you have a creed? Creeds. Uh, we're writing a Creed album right now. We got about five songs done right now. And then, um, now when was the last Creed album? Full Circle came out two or three years ago. Uh, but we're just, we don't have any timeline on it. We just want to make sure it's right before we put it out. And um, it's, it's coming along well. We go on tour in April. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're doing, um, we're touring differently this time. We're, we're going to do two nights in a row in theaters. First night we do our first album. Second night we do our second album. I've got an idea. Yeah. Giant Stadium, Creed, and Tenacious D. I'm in. I'm Who's in. in? I'm in. You think that'd be a good match? You guys headline it. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I think we'd have to be the Cold Stone Open. <laughs>